Namaste, Engineering Mathematics, Chapter Laplace Transforms. Evaluate the following integrals using Laplace Transforms. Problem number 33, integral of 0 to infinity, e power of minus t sin t whole divided by t into dt. So, problem number 33, integral of 0 to infinity, this one now. So, we know that integral of 0 to infinity e power of minus st e power of minus t sin t whole divided by t into dt. This is Laplace transform of e power of minus t sin t divided by t. Mm. Call it as equation number 1. This is from Laplace transformer. Laplace transform of f of t equal to integral of 0 to infinity e power of minus is t f of t into dt. So, from that formula. Okay, next. So, we want to find out the Laplace transform of e power of minus t sin t whole divided by t. So, Laplace transform of e power of minus t sin t whole divided by t. So, apply the third property of Laplace transformer. So, that is integral of S to infinity Laplace transform of e power of minus t sin t into ds. So, Laplace transform of e power of minus t sin t. Here, I am going to apply first property of Laplace transformer. So, integral of S to infinity Laplace transform of sin t s tends to s plus here t a value is minus 1 no? so a is minus or minus or plus so minus or minus or plus 1 no? so this ds ds as it is next laplace transform of sin t integral of s to infinity laplace transform of sin t is 1 divided by s square plus 1 square 1 square is 1 into ds and here put s tends to s plus 1 okay next equal to integral of s to infinity 1 divided by s is s plus 1 s is s plus 1 whole square plus 1 into ds we know the formula for integral of uh, 1 divided by 1 plus x square into dx is tan inverse of x. So, take that formula. Integral of 1 divided by 1 plus x square into dx equal to tan inverse of x. So, here tan inverse of yes. Uh, so, this one is s plus 1 whole square. Not whole square. s plus 1 only. So, limit is s to infinity. s to infinity. Okay, integral of 1 divided by 1 plus x square into dx is tan inverse of x. So, x is s plus 1. So, first apply the upper limit equal to tan inverse of infinity plus 1 is infinity. Next, minus, this is upper limit, lower limit is tan inverse of s plus 1, s plus 1. So, tan inverse of infinity is 90 degree or pi by 2 radian minus tan inverse of s plus 1. So, pi by 2 minus tan inverse of s plus 1 is cot inverse of s plus 1. So, uh, Laplace transform of e power of minus t sin t divided by t is cot inverse of s plus 1. So, call it as equation number 3, uh, not 3, equation number 2. Substitute equation number 2 in equation number 1. Okay. So, equation number 1 is integral of 0 to infinity e power of minus st e power of minus t sin t whole divided by t into dt equal to Laplace transform of e power of minus t sin t divided by t is 
this one cot inverse of s plus 1 so cot inverse of s plus 1 so in the problem they ask uh, uh, integral 0 to infinity e power of minus t sin t divided by t into dt in this problem e power of minus st is not there so therefore put s equal to 0 in the abo abo equation or equation number call it as equation number 3 ok anything in the abo expressions or equation so integral of 0 to infinity e power of uh, s value is 0 z e power of 0 is 1 so e power of minus t sin t divided by t into dt equal to cot inverse of s is 0 0 plus 1 is 1 so cot inverse of 1 is 45 degree or pi by 4 pi by 4 radian or 45 degree this is the answer for this one.